Hey guys, what's up? It's Lake here coming out to you with another video. Now today I'm going to be doing a video on the updated version of how to um, stream or record your PS4 from OBS without a capture card. And uh, a lot of people were having struggles because I was using um, the OBS I was using right now, the one that is now no longer, I guess, used because this is my AMD version. But I'll be showing you how to do it on the newer OBS Studio right here and with the latest version of PS4 Remote Play because some things have changed since the last video and that video was really popular so I decided to bring you guys a video of that. Um, so first what you're going to need is obviously a PS4, a PS4 Remote Play um, which can be downloaded from the link down below or just look up PS4 Remote Play and OBS uh, which is now OBS Studio. Um, now what you need to do first before I can um, before you can do this whole process is on your PS4 uh, go to settings go down to remote connection settings and check enable remote play um, it's pretty simple I'll show you eventually later in the video um, how to do that when I actually pop up the PS4 screen um, so let's do that right now um, you just want to install the PS4 remote play application and then open it now plug in a uh, DualShock 4 or your PS4 controller through the cable that came with your PS4 and um, and then hit start. Now it's gonna search for a new, uh, PS4. Um, actually, let me show you something real quick. Um, the first time you sign in, um, or the first time this app opens, it's going to ask you um, a few questions. Um, and let me just guide you through that process real quick. Um, so it's gonna load up here. Uh, you're gonna want to go to settings. Um, you're going to sign in if you can, uh, just sign in, I already did that. Um, choose your quality so you can do up to 1080p, um, high frame rate, whatever. Um, text entry, you can use keyboard. Eventually, hopefully you can use keyboard and mouse to actually play. Um, so that's some settings you can check. Um, so let's just start this up. Um, so this is the first step, you'll connect to the PS4. And uh, this should just pop up. Um, it should take uh, the first time it'll take a while um, and then after that it'll be less time and less time every time so as you can see right here we do have my PS4 on the screen right now um, so let me just quick show you um, the um, uh, setting we need to do uh, go down to remote play connection settings and enable it it's pretty simple that's what you have to do before but I just want to show you guys that for you that watched the video early um, so basically now we got our PS4 screen now we want to record it with OBS now basically what you want to do is open OBS studio and then when this pops up um, you want to go to scene um, you can make a new one say PS4 really you can name it whatever you want then for sources hit plus um, then we'll do a um, some of this will work, some won't. So uh, let's do a window capture. Hit OK. Now um, we can hit PS4 Remote Play and hit OK. Now as you can see, we have our full thing. Drag it to the full size, then click off. And now this whole thing will be recorded. Um, so obviously go like, um, we'll put this right here. Or we'll put this to one side hopefully. If I can get it to go, well, whatever, we'll put it down here. I'll put this over here, this over here, kind of. Um, so basically, what we need to do right now is uh, you can hit settings. Um, obviously, set up all this stuff how you want it to be, all the encoding. Um, generally, here you want to have uh, either hardware MD or a software x two eighty x two six four. I'm at a bit rate about that from uh, probably 3,000 for streaming if you're going to be doing streaming. I do about anywhere from 10,000 to 20,000 um, bit rate for if you're actually just recording a video. Um, but that depends how good your CPU or in my case I can use graphics card too. Um, so basically you'll see this will happen right here. Um, just make sure it's windowed. And then uh, obviously you can hit uh, start recording. Uh, start streaming and uh, it will record as you can see your PS4 screen and that was a simplified version of it that I can show you so uh, this video was really short and I hope you guys do get some uh, good information from this and can use this on your channel 
because when you can use OBS, use overlays, and use all that great stuff, um, it is so much better uh, for your channel. And I know not everybody can afford a you know, capture card like I have my Elgato, but not everyone can afford that. And I couldn't afford that at first either when I first started my channel. Um, but yeah, now you can do it. Uh, use the software and make it look very professional on your channel. So thanks for watching, guys. If you did uh, like this video, make sure to drop a like down there. Comment any comments or um, struggles you're having, uh, any questions. I'll try to answer the most I can. And if you do see something down there and you know the answer, please answer the people because um, I can only answer so many because these videos get a lot of um, views. But uh, thanks for watching, guys. Please rate, comment, like, subscribe. I'll see you in my next video, guys. Peace out.